Hey guys, I thought I would actually do a commentary playthrough of Ruiner. I just basically picked up the game for like 10 bucks. Normal price is around 24 or so. Um, kind of reminds me of when I was trying out Gauntlet back in the day. Okay. I find it weird that I have to be facing the right way to attack. So I guess, in a sense, that's cool in a, in a way that might be actually bad. I'm so used to, I guess, Gauntlet, where depending on the direction you're facing, you'll just automatically attack in that direction. So... Nice. I got hit, but I am just starting. I think this is pretty much the tutorial, of course, right? Because it's teaching me the game prompts and how to move and how to attack and blah, blah, blah. Um, the main reason why I picked this up is because I saw some gameplay of it and I found, well, I did find it interesting that I wanted to try it out and see if I like it or hate it. And since I got it for like pretty much like half off, I decided why not? Okay, doing good so far, I think. I'm assuming that, yeah, that's the heal. Come on, you asshole. I will end you. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's how you do it. Ah, oh, and suddenly my nose is freaking itchy as hell. Oh, I was like slightly off. Freak. Oh shit. I went to go scratch my nose and freaking got attacked. Exactly at that moment. Whoa. Cool. I killed them both at the same time. Though I think later on it's going to be more difficult, of course. Um, I'm trying this game out on normal. I'm not expecting not to die. I, I did look at the achievements, and there's an achievement to beat the game on uh, without dying. And I'm assuming this is probably going to be when you're not playing the game on easy. Otherwise, the achievement might not pop up. Cool. Different abilities. Okay. I would rather have the shield, I think, because it probably would guard me. Okay. There we go. I gotta admit, it does look pretty cool so far. Well, yeah, that's not energy, that was healing. God, I didn't. Okay. Oh, so you can actually 
Smash right into them. Cool. Okay. There we go. See, I think I'm getting a little the hang of this a little bit. I'm not going to be no grandmaster for this for a while, but I think I got the idea how to play this game. So that's the that's a good thing. Now we got a gun, then we get to test this out. Okay, cool. I Okay. So I'm assuming um nice. Hmm. That might be difficult later. I got to admit that. I think this might be up there. Okay, so I'll dash all waypoints. And over here. Cool. HB1. Yay. Though I kind of wish that the thing was not the way it is. Like, for example, Not very good at these type of shooters though, that's the thing. Well, I was decent at Gauntlet, but I don't know. Is that, like for an example, uh, my big gripe that I'm having with the game right now is that uh, if I remember, I could be wrong. In Gauntlet, when you press up, you would just start attacking. You press this, you would start attacking. You press this, you start attacking. And depending on whatever direction, you would keep doing your attacks. Or depending on the position position that you were... Uh, oh, fuck, I haven't played the game forever. But I do remember when I was playing the Archer... Or green elf, whatever. I can see you. Ah. I'm pretty sure I'm just forgetting how to how the game actually works because the last time I played it was like years ago, and it was on the free to play game on the PlayStation, and I don't have a PlayStation Pass, so I can't even play the games that uh, 
I got for free, unless I, you know, pay for the pass. Ooh. Ah. Fuck. It's like I said, a terrible shot. I'm like better off just meleeing. Don't what? Don't do what? I gotta admit, the animations are freaking smooth as fuck. Like, it's go it, it looks good, it plays perfect. Uh, it's just me, it's just me. I have to get used to the game. Maybe I'm remembering it different, or... But I could really dig this weapon locker. And what am I going to get? Shotgun, six rounds. I kind of wish that you can hold more than one fucking gun, though. Wait. <laughs> I didn't realize you could do that. Um, yeah, you can drop weapons. Oh, okay. I don't know. Crap. Shit. Oh, that's terrible. I can't believe I'm doing. Wake up. But I don't want to wake up. Yeah, I gotta get used to this. I think if I do this enough, I will eventually get to it. Because it's like... Okay. I want you guys to let me know how Gauntlet and a couple of these top-down shooters... Because I remember I even played Hatred at one point, And I'm like, I don't remember it being like this. Where it, you had to be like this and then pressing a button to attack you could just point in a direction and start shooting or whatever but like i said the last time i played these top down games is like gauntlet back on the ps4 years ago and hatred on the pc about a couple years ago i think i uploaded only one video and that was it so Hmm. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, so I guess... Huh. What? I got him. Cool. That was interesting mechanic, I must say. Killing your other enemies within the thing to keep going. Otherwise, you die. It's like adding an extra difficulty type of thing on top. Um... I welcome it, but at the same time, I hope it's not too bullshit, like, way later. So. We'll see. We'll see. At least I finished the prologue. Got to try out the game, learn it. And let me know what you guys think. I might at least record one more episode after this. And go from there. Okay... Codename Wizard. Okay, he's an ex cop. Why does that sound like a Russian bar? But that, but that's beside the point. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I didn't know that. Um, that's kind of interesting. But uh, that's beside the point. Okay, cool. Bounties collected? Um, okay, no file, kill you, kill you, oh, you know what, I'll Check this out. To the kings. Start with the pawns. This one pawn. Okay. Talk to girl. Okay. Give me my eye on you. Don't believe in a bird future. 
Okay, I don't know. That might not be the guy I need to talk to. Um, <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Whoa. Hello, darkness. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tyranny of labels. Oh, God. <laughs> Church of Disorder. Oh, God. Uh, no. <laughs> I might have to do that when I'm not recording. <laughs> okay, so... You're handsome underneath? Sure, why not? That means I got a future date with Daisy. Oh, look at that. I'm making friends. <laughs> Talk to the hood. I think I'm already in the hood, man. Oh, fuck. Okay. Learn your future. Sure, why not? I thought this was going to be like one of those other games, kind of like, you know, Bayonetta or something like that, where you go like stage to stage to stage or something like that, or have like a main hub or something like this game has, but a lot less talking and you would just do more. But I don't mind. Cool. Uh, I got another quest. That's interesting. I kind of like that kind of concept, though. Hmm. Okay, so that's two quests that I got now. I wonder what's up here. Aw, oh, look at the poor kitty. Talk to Guy. Thanks, man. I'm good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Frown. Okay, we got a crazy lady. Sure, why not? I have a good, bad feeling about... Okay. Cat violated. <laughs> I 
Okay. Well, I guess I am technically doing a quest, so. Um. Better question is, is where the hell is the other cat? Cow. Bounties collected. I don't know how to do that one properly. Action as art, I like it, okay. Nod. Okay. Okay. La. Now I'm just curious where to find that other cat. Probably in some stupid weird spot in the freaking map. That's for sure. Overall, I think the game is actually not that bad. Oh yeah, you can't use your powers here, of course, because you're in a sanctuary. Well, I want to at least get this one cat. Hmm. I have to hack that door. Hmm. You're sweet. Unless I can access an area where the cab might be in. That's possible. Because, I, I, like I said, I just started. So I'm assuming, like, if you do a couple of different missions and stuff like that, you'll have to come back to the city here and uh, complete more of them. Okay, he's just going to say the same thing. Opportunist, hey? Okay. Okay, listen. Oh, shit. Wait, did I actually... <sighs> shit. I wonder if I actually by accidentally declined that. Oops. Uh oh. Oh. Okay. Don't know. Really don't know where it went. Or is, I should say. Other than that, uh, 
so far, I don't mind the game, but I think uh, the next time I do some recording, it'll probably be actually when I'm inside a dungeon or a level killing shit, because I don't want to record too much dead space. So, um, the next episode might have this at the start and then doing what I just said to kind of like break the pacing a bit. So, uh, catch you guys later.